In my last video I managed to get the Pegation Crystal from Cerberus and in this video I'm going to do a bunch of medium clue scrolls trying to get the Ranger Boots to actually make the Pegation Boots. The drop rate of the Ranger Boots from a medium clue scroll is 1 in 200 and I've done just above a 100. So in this video I'm going to try to get this to 201 because I'm going to be doing 100 medium clue scrolls. Of course I'm on the Archaeus spellbook, ready with a Dark Lure spell, going to go and catch a bunch of Eclectic Implings. I currently only have roughly 600 jars I might actually get some from my teammates or I will just do increments of like 500 implings do the clue scrolls and all the way until I have 100 stacked up so let's get started yo this guy's living up to his name you thick Jesus that is a thick man this is not looking good so far I've opened like 120 look at all the loot on the ground and I still have not got another medium clue scroll Sometimes that's how it goes, and it seems like I'm still not getting any, but uh, at least I've completed 5 so far, collected 500. I'm going to be collecting 500 every time, and uh, I'll show you guys how many caskets I get each 500 I catch. A bit unlucky, but not terribly bad. 17 medium clue scrolls from the first 500. It should have been 20, so not that bad, just slightly under the drop rate. But let's keep going. I actually went ahead and stacked up on some impling jars. I'm going to do 1000 now in a row. Maybe get a bit luckier because I don't want to go back and forth all the time. I think this is the best way of doing it. So 1000 implings from 17 medium caskets. Let's get it done. I think these are the last ones to have 1000 implings. Yes, look at that. 1023 implings and we have 17 medium caskets. Hopefully I do not get unlucky on this and actually it's worth 5 million almost on the main game. So if you want to make some money through Hunter, I guess this is a decent way of doing it. Didn't take too long. Getting kind of close to done with the 1000 implings, but after I bank this, we are halfway done. I'm at 50 caskets and I have 239 implings left, so I think I've been kind of on drop rate so far for these. Look at that, that is Impling Only, a YouTuber that makes videos on an ultimate Iron Man, basically locked to Piro Piro. I, you can see the stats on the right side there, I haven't really followed the series too much he's making, but I think basically most of it, at least the Hunter, is all from Piro Piro. This medium casket right here is the last one for the 100 medium clues I wanted to get, and it is now opening time, but before that, look at this. Let's deposit everything into the bank and that is now 100 medium caskets and there uh, should be a 50% chance of getting the ranger boots. But let's have a look at how many implings I caught in Piro Piro. 5069 eclectic implings but that is overall and I will have completed 201 medium clue scrolls after this so I am pretty much exactly on drop rate. But it is time to open all of them and see if we can actually manage to get those ranger boots. Let's first have a look at the collection log and go to the clue section. We have 30 out of 115 unlocks, so let's see what we can get to after these 100. And from 101 I got 30, so I would take a guess that I'm going to end at like 47, 48, something like that. Above that would be lucky I would say, because I of course can get duplicates, so somewhere around there would be pretty nice. I think I'm going to bank all the 100 right now, and I'm going to take out like 20 at a time. And do that because I will have to bank. But uh, yeah, let's see what we get for the first 20 clue scrolls. Master clue scroll right away. I'm kind of not interested in doing that. So I'm actually going to just keep that for now. And not really do any more master clue scrolls. Might do that in the future. But right now I just want to open all these medium clue scrolls. So let's see if we can get anything from these 20. The pages, I am not sure. I guess it wasn't a collection log. So I already had that most likely. And... Uh, these teleports, dig sites, of course I will be using all these teleports when I am doing more clue scrolls in the future, if I do not, well, we technically need 5 ranger boots, so I will need more of those anyways in the future, 10 more to go before I bank, there's a unique adamant cane, not bad, getting some more collection log items, stacking up, and 4 more, let's see 2 more, and the last one, not ranger boots. Of course, every single time I bank those 20 that I open, you can see all of the collection log items in the clan chat right here. It is going to be a lot of spam for the clan mates. Of course, we still have 80 left to go. Let's see what we get from these 20. First one is not too good. Another collection log item, ancient page. Some mediocres. Samurai page, 29,000. 
That is ridiculously low. I think when I started playing Old School RuneScape, they were hundreds of thousands of gold each, so kind of crazy how they dropped so much. Penguin Mask, is that a unique? Yes, it is. Very nice. Nothing too good there. Nothing, actually no boots at all so far. I'm not sure, I think it's like 1 in 40, 1 in 50 maybe to get any of the boots, which is Holy Sandals, Climbing Boots, Ranger Boots, Manacles, and I think I'm missing some Holy Sandals, I think I said those already. And uh, we have the Crier Bell, last four ones. I can actually show you guys, by the way, in the clan, when I close this, you can see all the collection log items popping up. Let's do that right now. And, oh my god, look at that, that is crazy. No ranger boots yet, though. Of course, the boots I forgot about was the wizard boots. So you can either get the ranger boots, wizard boots, holy sandals, spiked manacles, or climbing boots G. And I actually already have the climbing boots, I think, yeah, right there. We have 40 clues left, by the way, and these 20, so 60 overall. I just want to get any of the boots, but of course, rangers would be the best ones to get. So let's continue opening. Getting some more collection log items right away. Some fashion scape, like free to play, adamant G. I wonder how much that's actually worth if people in free to play are uh, making them worth quite a bit. Maybe they are. Still no boots. More than halfway done now. That is Gnomish Firelighter. I already have those. I do not have the page. I guess we are going to complete some books here. Should do that for sure. And the last one for these 20. Nothing too good. But collection log pop ups again. Only three this time. Down to the last 40. RNG says this is the time we want the ranger boots. Please. Oh, there we go. That is the boots I wanted. One of the boots I really wanted actually, because those are the second best. I think ranger boots are the best ones, but holy sandals are definitely really good. They're the same drop rate as basically every other unique on the drop table. Ranger boots is the same drop rate as adamant plate body T, whatever you're getting, of course. And getting these are really nice. They have a really high prayer bonus. They have a plus three, but also from Drakes, you can kill them and they drop an attachment that I think doubles it, which means plus six in boot slot is ridiculously good. So let's keep opening. Let's see if we can get anything more. That's a collection of item, I'm pretty sure. Yes, I did not have that before. What teleports are these? High worth camp teleports. I don't think, I don't know if I've got those before. Maybe I have. Another pair of holy sandals? No way, these, these, the guys in the clan is going to freak out, look at this. Dude, there is no way, almost, that was so close. Can we get ranger boots now as well? Another stole, band of stole, very nice. Are we actually going to get two holy sandals as the boots uh, from all of these 100 clues? Honestly, that's, I'm, I'm happy with that, even if I haven't got the ranger boots yet, having two holy sandals is definitely not bad. Like Max Nick is saying, where's the rangers? Hopefully in the last 20 we can get those, but let's have a look at the collection log. We are now at 45. Did I predict 47, 48, something like that? So if we get two more or three more, I was pretty much dead on. But uh, let's see if we can get that last 20 medium clues for the grind. This took a very long time, by the way. I could have probably done this in like two days if I spent the entire days doing it. Maybe you can do it faster as well, I'm not completely sure, but on drop rate is 2,500 eclectic implings caught, and I feel like I was slightly unlucky at times. I think I had to catch like 3,000 of them. So uh, yeah, let's see what we get for the last 20 caskets. Nothing so far. It's not looking good at all. That is another unique, so up at 46 uniques now. Oh, I think I already got that. Yeah, I got that pretty early on. This has to be a unique. Yes, it is. Okay, 47 uniques now, so I'm at the points I expected. And another one, so 48. Can we actually reach 50? I might be able to reach 50 because we just got that mitre. That is a duplicate. I have three of those now. Last 10. No ranger boots so far. Is my pigation crystal not going to be able to be used in the foreseeable future? Because I am going to take a break from medium clue scrolls after this one. But the amount of uniques I am getting is pretty crazy. Ooh, this is very rare, I think. I have the... Oh, never mind. It's the same drop rate as everything else. I think the age items in some cases are very rare, but maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's from hard clue scrolls or something. But uh, last two caskets out of 100 clue scrolls, do I get the ranger boots? One more to go. The answer is... I did not. But we got two holy sandals and a bunch of collection log items. Let's go in and see the final judgment. 51. 
That is really good. From 30 to 51. And I've done 201 crew scrolls. And this is what the log looks like. I can go all the way from the bottom. Scroll up a bit. And you can see what I have. There is a YouTube called Guides for Us All. I'm sure you know who it is. He did thousands of clue scrolls and did not get the black headband. It looks like I am on the same track. We've got a couple of the other ones, but not the black headband. I think it's maybe the age helmets that are more rare, or maybe that is also from hard clue scrolls. I'm not completely sure. No, they seem to be all on the same drop rate. But yeah, you can see the boots here. No wizard boots, no manacles, no ranger boots, but two holy sandals. Now some interesting stats possibly, Eclectic Implings on a main account is 5000 GP, you need to open 25 of them for one medium clue scroll on average, so 125,000 GP per clue scroll, but if we go here to loot, if you get no ranger boots, you are going to lose money, 52,000 GP on average, which is definitely not bad for medium clue scrolls, but on this drop rate you actually should expect to get ranger boots. Roughly at least. It's 1 in 200. And if you do get ranger boots, they are, if I can type, dude, what am I doing? If I can type correctly, they are 44 million almost. And that actually puts the average value, if I would get one pair here, up to around 270k. So essentially, if you're buying the Eclectic Implings on a main account, and you're doing the medium clue scrolls, and you get the ranger boots on drop rate over like a thousands of clue scrolls, you're going to essentially double your money, which is very interesting. It's a good way of making money if you enjoy doing clue scrolls. I think mediums are definitely the best way of making money through clue scrolls on a main account. This video might have been a bit shorter. Honestly, I have no idea how long it is, but I wanted to make it only about the medium caskets, so I'm actually going to end the video here. But before I leave you guys, the next video I make is not going to be on the group Iron Man. It is going to be a completely new idea for a series on my main account. It is not the collection log uh, item series that I suggested on my community page. It is actually something completely different that I talked to a couple of people about. And I think it's a really fun idea. And uh, I hope you guys will enjoy that video. I am going to put a lot of effort into it and really think through how I'm going to do the series. And I'm going to be grinding things to my group Iron Man at the same time. So please wait for that video and please look at it when it comes out. If you enjoy the series idea, then let me know. If you do not enjoy it, let me know that as well. But uh, hope you guys are having a good day. Until next time, guys. Take care.